There are new clues tonight in the effort to identify a woman whose body was found along I-85 in Banks County last year. Uh, this is a new sketch and reconstruction of what the woman might have looked like. Now, it's a story that you'll only see here on Fox 5. And as our Claire Sims reports, this is the first case where the Georgia Bureau of Investigation's forensic artist is using a new technique in the hopes that someone will recognize her. And you yes. loop it. For Kelly Lawson, it's all about the details. And I really try to give every ounce of energy that I have in making it realistic and beautiful. As a forensic artist at the Georgia Bureau of Investigation, she spends her days sketching suspects and bringing the dead back to life through her drawings. But it's the case of this woman in Banks County that inspired her to draw on her creativity in a new way when she couldn't find the right wig to complete her 3D facial reconstruction. I had a friend here at GBI and I was somewhat lamenting to her about how I couldn't find the perfect wig for this particular reconstruction. And she said, Kelly, why don't you just make your own wig? According to investigators, someone discovered the woman's remains in commerce about a mile off I-85 in February 2017. They believe she died about four years earlier. Experts say she was between 30 and 44 years old with African-American and Hispanic features. I think she turned out beautiful. Lawson says making her own wigs gives her more flexibility to make the reconstructions look more realistic than just using a wig off a shelf. I can use different pieces from different wigs or different types of, of hair and put them all together into one wig in an attempt to make a better suited piece for each individual case. As Lawson worked to recreate the woman's face, scientists at the University of North Texas extracted a DNA profile. Between the DNA as well as the sketch and reconstruction, we are really hoping that we can give her a name. Lawson says she spent more than 100 hours on this reconstruction, and the wig was just a fraction of that. But she believes it could be that extra detail that helps someone identify identify her after all these years. You really feel like you get to know a person and it becomes very important to you. If it's important to me, imagine how much more important it is to a family somewhere. At GBI headquarters, Claire Sims, Fox 5 News.